This recipe could not be easier. My coworker, RJ, was so sweet. He went fishing the other day and he caught this beautiful Spanish mackerel. I love them with the beautiful yellow spots on it. You could use any fish though for this recipe. Um, I know some people don't really like Spanish mackerel. It can be oily and fishy, but this recipe really takes it all out with the cilantro, lemon, garlic, some cumin, coriander. You'll see, you will be so surprised if you happen to get your hands on a Spanish mackerel. I highly encourage you to make this dish. Again, it would work with any fish though. So stick around because y'all, it's gonna happen so quickly. To begin, we'll just take the zest of one lemon, the garlic, and we'll put it in our mortar and pestle or a food processor and we'll really grind that down. Then we'll add some cilantro, salt, pepper, the lemon juice of that whole lemon, and we'll kind of grind it as much as we can. Obviously with a mortar and pestle, you're gonna kind of get this chunky situation. You could definitely put it in a food processor, but I just loved how this looked. Now we'll spread that all over the flesh side of our fish fillets, kind of press it down so you make sure it's on there. And when I tell you this marinade takes all the oily and fishiness out of this Spanish mackerel, I can't even begin to describe to you how good it was. I was honestly very surprised. A lot of people will uh, smoke this fish or really dry it out to get rid of all that oiliness, um, but you won't need to do that here. In fact, I added a little bit of olive oil to this marinade to make sure it really could spread onto this fish nicely. Now we'll pop it into an oven at 450 degrees cook it for about 20-25 minutes until that flesh can easily flake away with a fork. I told you, this one is really easy. And here you go, it's all done. You could serve this with some rice or some veggies to have a complete meal, but I really encourage you guys to try this one because it was so delicious and it really would be good on any fish that you have on hand, not just a Spanish mackerel. So I hope y'all try this one out.